Hi, this is Dr. Melissa Grohls coming to you again from Rock Creek Spine and Rehabilitation Center. Our last video, we talked about five things to take out of your diet to reduce your inflammation. Let's talk about some things you can put in your diet to help reduce that inflammation even further. Um, number one, hands down, green vegetables. I just grabbed an assortment out of my fridge. Kale, butter, lettuce, peas, celery, Anything that is green and non-starchy is likely going to be loaded with antioxidants, vitamins, nutrients, and most importantly, fiber. The more we can try to push five to nine servings of vegetables a day, that really helps your inflammation to drop and your tissues to heal further. Number two is fish oil. Um, fish oil, everyone hears a lot about, nobody really knows what it does. There are two main components to fish oil, EPA and DHA. You don't really need to worry about that too much. Other than to know that fish oil is a very strong anti-inflammatory and it is a great thing to get into your daily routine. Um, it can be liquid or it can be capsules. You can pick some up at the store. We sell some in our office. Generally, you wanna be around 3,000 milligrams a day. Unless you are on a blood thinner, then you don't wanna go over 2,000 milligrams a day. Example of a blood thinner would be a daily dose of mini aspirin, warfarin, coumadin. Those things are already blood thinners, and so you don't wanna go over 2,000 milligrams on a fish oil. If you're not on one of those products, then a higher dose of fish oil is great for you. Another very common thing that you can grab from the store or order online is turmeric. Doing a daily dose of turmeric in your morning vitamin regimen is a very strong anti-inflammatory and is a great thing to add while we're working on healing your spine because it will help your tissues to heal faster. Number four, water. I know you've heard it your whole life, but it is so critically important that you keep your tissues hydrated. Here in Colorado, we are very dry, and so I really recommend you do 80 to 100 ounces of water a day. Yes, that's a lot. Yes, you should do it. Um, it's a great way to keep your tissues pliable, and their pliability and their lack of inflammation are things that really help them heal faster so they can get you out of pain and get you back to your daily activities. Again, if you have any questions, you can call me or text me at 303-548-3841. Follow me on Instagram at drmelissagrolls. I have a ton of recipes posted there to help you incorporate these things into your daily life in an easy yet delicious way. Um, and in the meantime, drink a lot of water. Please be kind to everyone you meet and be very conscious of moving your body at least 60 minutes every single day. Take care.